Hello everybody, this is Inglorious P back on video today and today on this Sunday just wanted to point out that the LeBron James triple logo man has sold at auction for 2.4 million dollars um, for those that don't know it featured NBA logo patches from three of his jerseys from his time in Cleveland, Miami, and LA. Before I dive in any further please like, comment, subscribe let me know what y'all think below. Hope your weekend's been going well. Let's kind of dive into this article by NBA.com. It was sold last night on Golden.com. Um, someone has paid $2.4 million for a one-of-a-kind LeBron James trading card. A purchase price that fell well short of what some expected. The auction of the Triple Logo Man ended Saturday. Officials at Golden, which ran the auction, suggested... It could fetch the largest price ever for a card. It didn't come close. The record remained $6.6 million for a Honus Wagner card last year. It was part of Panini's Flawless Collection and features patches. That's the card if you haven't seen it. Um, that's kind of what it looks like. It, f it features the three patches. The Lakers one is like kind of looks like rubberish, to be honest. Um, compared to the other two, it looks, you know, st stitched. This 2.4 million isn't even a record for a card featuring James. A card from his rookie season sold for 5.2 million last year. He's on pace to be the NBA career scoring leader. Um, should pass it next season. My thoughts on this: completely overhyped. The rest of the card market knew it. Um, sports card YouTubers, I'll give them credit, knew it. Um, honestly, if you were to come to me, I had all the money in the world, right? And you're saying glorious. I have this triple logo man for sale with LeBron James. I need the money. What can you give me? Right? What what do you value this? What what can you pay me? Right? And maybe it doesn't have the media. We don't know all the background behind this card, right? I would venture to guess it's worth probably a hundred grand. And I know that sounds low. I'm I personally, even if I had all the money in the world, I would give you a hundred grand for this. Maybe 250 at the high end if I felt like you were, you know, like if there's a story to it, maybe I did more research. And here's why I'm at 100,000. For 75,000, let, let me ask you this. Comment below. Comment question of the day. Would you rather have this card or a dual patch Michael Jordan, LeBron James card? It's not a rookie card, let's just say, but it's a patch. Game used patches of Michael Jordan and LeBron both signed it. Um, it's on eBay right now for $75,000. Um, you can look it up. It's an upper, upper deck, I think, 06 card. Which one would you rather have? Michael Jordan and LeBron James Auto with patches from game, uh, game used patches or this triple logo, man? Um, I understand this is a one of one, you know, unique. So far, there, you know, there might be another one in the future, right? But as of now, this is the only one. But I would, to me, I would rather just have a whole game used <clears throat> a whole game used jersey by LeBron. If you're if you're asking me, I would rather have a whole game used jersey of LeBron, something I can hang up, um, you know, put it in a little case, hang it up on the wall, maybe especially if I can get him to sign it. That's worth it to me. Not three patches of a card. But maybe I'm wrong. Comment below, just a short video today. Comment what you guys think. Do you agree, disagree? Is a sale too high, too low? Love to hear it all. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.